Another accuser comes out and basically says me too. It's a break time. Let's talk about it. It's very unfortunate. I hate that a lot of accusers are starting to come out and he has not been able to defend himself before everybody just start pulling deals and talking out the side of their neck without the facts. If this were a white guy, and yes, I'm going there, it would not be the same way. His deals would still be intact. He would still be working. He would not be blackballed. And I'm sorry, no one else is saying it, so I'm going to say it. A pair of lips can say anything, especially a paid pair of lips can say anything. Because at the end of the day, what is it? It's giving me Hollywood weird stuff like a lot of other things that go on. Because first of all, all these people that's coming out from the past, show us some receipts. Where are the receipts? Show us the police reports. Let us hear about how you sat in an investigation room and told your story. I don't want to just hear what you're saying right now because anybody can get a couple bucks put in their pocket, their tuition paid for, things done under the table for you to throw this man under the bus with things that are just not true. I really, truly feel like, and this is my opinion, that he done something to piss off a big person a higher up and they are sticking it to him just like a, Des a Deshaun Watson. Excuse me. Honestly, that's exactly how I feel because something is just not sitting right. It's not sounding right to me. So I want to know what you guys think. Do you feel like he's guilty? Are you waiting until you get the facts? Or you just like to hell with him, burn the whole bridge down? If his career where are you with it? I would love to know how you guys feel about Jonathan Majors and this whole stinky, stinky situation. Like I said, not how I feel. It's break time. Let's discuss it. <laughs>